Hey, how you doing? It's Buddy from Capistrano Volkswagen, the sales and internet manager. I thought I'd send you a video of the 2019 uh, Volkswagen Passat Wolfsburg. Uh, check out this walk around. All right, I wanted to send you this video. Uh, we did not have any uh, Wolfsburgs available, but I do have this pre-owned uh, Passat R-Line. Um, it just came uh, to us uh, as a service owner um, out of my fleet. It has no miles on it whatsoever. It has uh, 5,000 miles on it. I still have new programs on this car. Um, so I wanted to show you the features between the Wolfsburg Edition that you were asking for and this one. First of all, the looks. Uh, the very aggressive, uh, very front end of the car. Also the lighting package. The lighting package uh, does about another 75 yards down uh, the road so you can uh, have better visibility on dark roads. Uh, the 19 inch wheels and all the badging, also the skirts on the side. It's the prettiest Passat they ever made. This is by far one of the prettiest Passats they have ever made. You go around the back side too. The LED lights in the back, yes they do resemble Audi. We own Audi, So very nice lights all the way around. The little thing on the bottom right there. Mine's black, I have a black one with a tan interior. Uh, a lot of people uh, are in love with the Passat R-Line because of all the extra features that it has. Um, let me also go on the inside and show you that too. Right, R-Line badging in the door. Support of your pedals. It also has a nicer trim on the inside of the car. It also has a nav, which the um, other one does not have. They both do have Apple CarPlay or Android Auto, but this one has a navigation system, so you don't have to use the, the data on your phone. Um, it's really nice, too. Really easy to use. You can actually be like, I have a friend that lives right over in that area. It'll actually pull it up and be like, all right, I'll take you straight there. Um, you can do everything by voice if you want to. Um, it also has a nice parking sensor um, all the way around, which the uh, Mossberg does not have. Um, so if I hit this little button, let me show you. If I hit my parking sensor button, now I got parking sensors for the front, back, and side of the vehicle. That's pretty sweet. So that gives you a little bit extra uh, protection on the car. You do have the autonomous braking up front. If anyone cuts you off, your car will brake slowly, or if someone cuts you right off right away, it will brake pretty hard. Uh, it's designed to stop before you hit another vehicle. Also, I have the blind spot monitoring sensors right here in the mirror on the side. And also do have rear traffic on the car if you're backing up and it senses someone with the radar. It gives you a small beep if you do not stop it actually uh, locks your brakes down so you do not get rear ended. Alright, so when you're driving, you're pulling out. It's going to kind of show you where you're going. Satellite radio, uh, it does have Bluetooth audio, um, AM, FM, of course, and uh, since this is the loaded one, you also get SXM. What that is, when you have your satellite radio turned on, you also have uh, live traffic, weather, uh, snow falls up on Big Bear, it shows you um, how much is dropped there. Sports, it keeps you the scores of your favorite team. Movies, all right, we want to go to the movie theater at the Kaleidoscope. It shows me movie times and the movies that are showing and fuel prices, uh, the best prices in my area or unless I specific, uh, specifically put a zip code to there. Um, so it just helps you find everything easier instead of going to your phone. It's already on the car. Dual climate control, which is nice, but uh, push button start. Beautiful car. Cool thing about the navigation system when you run it in this vehicle, uh, just think points of interest, gas station, let's pull up all the gas stations. So if I happen to pick this one, it's going to say, are you sure you want to go there so I could save it? Or if it's a restaurant, I could actually make a call for reservations. If I hit start, instead of looking here, it also shows you right here. So you don't have to look away. Um, you don't have to look at the screen. It'll be displayed right here for you as well. Uh, you do can control your um, your voice command and also your radio stations from here. And that cool little orange thing right there is your lane assist. Anything at 40 miles an hour, if you took your hands off the steering wheel, it'd stay inside that lines automatically for you. Um, just for a couple seconds. You're not supposed to be driving this car autonomous, but just in case if you're not paying attention, it does it for you. And it also has the um, blinds. I'm sorry, the adaptive cruise control. So these are a lot of things that the Wolfsburg will not give you. Now 
And one more thing I forgot to tell you about, the car has a remote start, something else that the Wolfsburg does not have. All right, once again, it's Buddy from Capital VW. Hope you like my video of the uh, Passat R line. Please let me know how I can help. Love to send numbers or what have you. Have a great day. Hope you're enjoying your Wednesday. Wednesday for us is Purple Day, but still Hump Day. Have a great day. Take care.